Okay. I am not trying to be gross or anything like that. Please believe me. There have been people who asked me to pray for them about the issue of masturbation. And I believe I have shared some things about my personal life pertaining to masturbation, excuse me. So let me share some more and I am not trying to be nasty. This may be encouragement. Okay. Myself, I believe I used to be very big in masturbation. Even when I had, how can I say this? When it came down to a woman I was with or masturbation, I would favor masturbation more than actual intercourse, if you understand what I am trying to tell you. Because for me, it was much more convenient than messing with a woman. And there were days where I would masturbate probably out a week. I probably didn't do it every day, but I believe some weeks, I think I would do it every day. Some weeks, I believe. And on some days, maybe up to three or four times. So I believe I had a very, very strong lust spirit. Hopefully, I don't have it now. I believe I had it so strong. And masturbation, or should I say lust in general, I believe that was, when I was in sin, one of the things I had the hardest time stopping. I'm serious now. Like, masturbation to me, how can I put it? Let me say it like this. Masturbation to me was a very, very huge part of my life. I remember a time, and I don't know if it was because of lust or was it because how mean I was. I believe, you know, I used to go to bars and I guess they are called, yeah, I used to go to bars and to, I guess they are called maybe clubs or dance bars. I was a very lustful person and I believe it came a time this may sound silly or I'm crazy or something like that, whatever. I believe it came a time to where maybe, let me see, maybe right in the middle of my chest or in this area, If I am saying this correctly, I believe I could feel like a, like a 
code energy or some type of energy like right in this area here and I guess to <laughs> other people that may that may have that probably would have freaked them out but for me I guess how bad I was back then I don't think it really freaked me out and I kind of figured I believe I kind of figured that it was a demon and when I had that energy inside of me or whatever that thing was demon whatever I believe it made should I even say this? Whatever. So, I was a very, 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 very lustful person. Especially when it came down to masturbation. It was a very large part of my life. But now, I don't believe I masturbate and you may say what do you mean by that and I may get to that later so you may want to know how can you stop let me say this when you stop or if you stop <laughs> I don't think it is going to be easy. Let me tell you what happens to me. I think I get messed with in my sleep so much. So much. There are times, I believe there are times, I guess while I am dreaming or whatever it is called, I have a hard time realizing if it is actual life or a dream or whatever. Like, I think there are times it is hard to tell. I'm being serious. I am being serious. So sometimes I have dreams that I'm doing this bad thing and that bad thing and I wake up, but I think it feels so real as if I am actually, you know, whether I'm masturbating. I don't know if I had too many dreams about masturbating, but like having sex. Yes, I think I have. I believe in those dreams or whatever you want to call them like I'm either masturbating or having sex and stuff like that and while I am doing it or however it is structured it seems like I am actually doing it man and sometimes while in my dreams I'm doing a certain thing to the point when I'm waking up it's like I'm kind of in that, if you know what I mean. Like I am in that process still, I guess. So, if that counts as masturbation or whatever, or pressing down on something or whatever, hey, you know. But... I guess it would count as masturbation then. But uh, you may wonder how you can stop. Stop masturbating. Don't expect it to be easy. Now, I don't know how everyone's experiences are. But from my experiences, if you stop masturbating, 
don't expect it to be easy because I believe demons will mess with your dreams. Of course, pray, pray about it. And I have prayed about it so many times. But I believe it comes back to that scripture and I don't have it on me now, but I believe it states something like resist the enemy and he shall flee or something like that. So that may be in, I don't know. So I am paraphrasing a bit, I guess. But the things that helped me, I believe, is praying. I believe I have fasted about it, I think. I think so. Watch the music, movies, media, or whatever else. Watch those things. As in, be careful of those things. If whatever you are listening to, how could I say this? Don't listen to anything sexual or about any type of sin, really. Be careful of what you look at. I think in this day of age, there are so women dressed in a very exposing type of way. And a person may say, well, you know, that is not the problem of the woman of how she may want to dress. And I believe that is false. Will God accept you into heaven wearing exposing type of clothes? I don't think so. Do you think the angels in heaven are wearing apple bottoms and leggings and yoga pants and halter tops, you know, like that? If I am saying that right, I believe they are those things that cover, I guess, the top, but exposes the stomach or something like that. Whatever they are called. Do you believe angels are dressed in that way? I don't think so. I believe the men and women angels are covered from wherever down to their feet or something like that. Which I believe I have seen an angel before. I think the same one, maybe two or more times. <laughs> Not in like, I don't think in actual, you know, life, but I guess in what people may call a night vision or whatever they are called, which seemed so real. But ultimately, so let me get back to my point. When it comes down to trying to stop masturbation, you have to resist. Now, if there was an easy way, <laughs> please believe me, I think I would be doing it right now. But I believe I have told you things that will help. I don't think there is some type of pill or something that will help you to stop masturbating. Like me, I think there are some times when I am attacked so hard to where it feels like I am holding on by a thread. As in like, I am so close, or it feels like, I guess, I am so close to giving up, if you know what I mean. As in giving into that lust stuff. It is not, hey, it is not easy for me. I love God. My mind, most of the time, I think, is on God. I listen to teachings, pray, read the Bible, and still, that stuff comes to me, man. So if it comes to me, possibly, it is going to come to you. So ultimately, resist. 
be careful with what you look at and watch. Don't be around bad type of people. I could probably be around women and stuff like that. You know, I probably could, you know, do this and do that. But if it is going to cause me or influence me to sin, why do it? Huh? I believe back in the past, I think there have been people that offered me to do this and that with them. But if they aren't serving God, I have to be careful. Let me stop here. God bless you.